All right, this is specifically for Chase. All right, the uh, chorus to one starts on the third fret. It goes like this, and obviously we're going to turn them into power chords, but I'm going to just show you with my first finger so you can see what's going on. second fret on the second string over the A string. Strum the top two strings like that, like kind of like a train, so we can practice our strumming like this. <laughs> okay, so we take the D chord, which I know you know already. We're going to just start with just four strums on that. Okay, and when you play it, you want to avoid these top two strings here. Okay, then we go to middle finger on the A string, first finger on this next string back on the second fret, and we're going to go... Be great if you did it with your middle finger instead of your first finger, because it's already lined up with how the chords go. Um, I'll do it that way, but I, you know, we'll see what happens. So, okay. And then the other thing, if you get it really good, when you take the C at nine chord is what it's called. If you can put your pinky right there on the very last string and then your ring finger on the next string up on the third fret when you play both of those chords, that's really how they play it. If you get good at that, then you can strum all the strings down like everything.